families and individuals know that when they step through our front door, they will be welcomed and they will be welcomed warmly and without judgement. Social isolation is the number one cause of depression for the elderly. My biggest joy today was actually seeing my daughter and a lady colouring in. That for me is huge. What a difference we've made in her day. Every single woman and family that I work with have been affected in some way uh, by family violence. This is a huge problem. It's New Zealand wide. So listening to our communities and responding to what they're telling us is vital if we want to be relevant for the community. I'd love to say to all those beautiful teachers in there, thank you very much for making my three kids the way they are today, because without them, they could have been on a different path. At the heart, we love our community, and we love our whānau and our children as one. We don't say no to anybody. No matter what you've got going on, you're welcome. And we strive on having genuine relationships with our family. Anglican Care Waipu is the social services arm of the Anglican Diocese of Waipu. Our services are located in Bay of Plenty, Tairawhiti and Hawke's Bay. We partner with our communities and parishes to nurture lasting transformation. We're making a difference in this community, a marked difference. I'm seeing women grow. I'm seeing families safe. I'm seeing even our young men, um, they're changing when they come into the service. I like we're here because I make a difference. I make a difference in people's lives. In my first week I said, I haven't gained a job, I've gained a hundred nanas and granddads. So I really cherish these teachers in here and I love them for all they have done for me and my family and my community. I wish I could give them some more kids, but unfortunately I can't. <laughs> They know that when they come here, they're going to get a well-considered, well-thought-through service that's relevant for the family and is underpinned by good, sound evidence and research. It was really cool to hear that um, they were just there to help us and that they had our back and um, that anything we needed, they'd be there, that nothing was too hard for them. It's a pretty awesome feeling to know that there's people out there in the community that are there to help because asking for help is a big step to take. So if our communities are thriving, then our people are thriving. If our people are thriving, our children are thriving and our children are our future.